parents and children. I am Anita George, class teacher of 8th B. I facilitate the young brains of 8th A and B in mathematics. We all know that it's a particular circumstances of coronavirus infection worldwide. We have already started our academic year 2021 with online classes. Hope you all safely learn at home. It is a new experience for us in the initial stages you may find some difficulties. Try to concentrate well on available classes and resources. Wish you all a better learning ahead. So, dear students, I welcome all of you to our teaching and learning process. side, two side, three side. It is a three sided closed figure and it has three angles. Let X, second angle Y and third angle Z. Okay. Do you know how many types of Triangles are there? Yes? Good. There are mainly four types of triangles. First one, yes? Can you tell me? Equilateral triangle. It is equilateral triangle. Second one, isosceles triangle. Okay? And third, Scaling triangle. And the last one, fourth one is right angle triangle. So what is an equilateral triangle? An equilateral triangle is a triangle in which all three sides are equal. And all the three angles are equal with 60 degree. Okay. Then what is an isosceles triangle? Isosceles triangle is a triangle with two equal sides and two equal angles. Okay. Then what is scaling triangle? Scaling triangle is a triangle in which all three sides have different lengths. Also, the angles have different measurements. And the last one, right angle triangle. It is a triangle in which 
One angle is 90 degree. Okay students, we have revised about a triangle and different types of triangles. Now look at these two bottles. There are two bottles with me. One is green in color and another is red in color. If I place one bottle over the other, please look at this from distance. How do you feel? How many bottles are there? Please tell me how many bottles are here? You feel there is only one bottle in my hand. Actually, is it only one bottle? Please tell me. Okay. There are two bottles, but you feel from distance, you feel only one bottle. What is the reason for that? Just look at here. This side is equal to this side, isn't it? And see the base. Bases of these two bottles are same. And see its edges. Edges. It is also looking like and see the top. Top of these two bottles are also same. What it shows? These two bottles are equal in size and shape. So we can conclude that these two bottles are identical bottles or equal bottles. Isn't it? All of you open your notebook. Okay. Draw a triangle with any measurements you like. And name it A. B, C. In capital letters only. Okay, not it. Finish? Okay. Draw another triangle with the same measurements. Already you have taken in A, B, C. Same measurements. Okay. And name it P, Q, R. Are you ready? Finished. Now you look at here. Uh, you compare my triangles and also your triangles. Okay. If, if I am placing this triangle. Uh, no, this is not matching. It's not proper. I am just uh, turning. And uh, now look at here. Okay. How many triangles are here? What do you feel? It is looking like only one triangle, right? What is the reason? Just, just look at here. I am just uh, moving. So, second triangle. Now see it. AC. Side AC. Actually it is equal to P R. Write it down in your book. A C equal to P R. Write in capital letters only. You have to represent sides only in capital letters. Do not write small letters. Again look at second side of these two triangles. Okay. That is... AP is equal to PQ. Right? Write down. AB equal to PQ. And see the basis of these two triangles. What is that? BC equal to QR. Have you all completed? Just check the matching sides. A, B, equal to B, Q. Do you 
Do you get AB equal to PQ? Yes? Then put tick. Okay. Next, BC. BC equals QR. Hope you have got it. Isn't it? Right? And next side, third side is AC. AC equals PR. Right? AB equals PQ. BC equals QR. AC equals PR. These are the matching sides of these two triangles. Which two triangles? Triangle ABC. Three sides of a triangle ABC is equal to three sides of a triangle PQR. Let's look into the angles. Here angle A equal to angle P. Angle B equal to Angle Q, angle C equal to angle R. These are the matching angles. So write it down children. Angle A equal to angle P. Okay. Have you written? Angle B equal to Angle Q and angle C equal to angle R. Now you have written matching sides and also matching angles of these two triangles. So let me tell you once again. If three sides of a triangle ABC are equal to three sides of a triangle PQR, then angles of these two triangles are equal. So let me wind up the class with the first general principle. If the sides of a triangle is equal to sides of another triangle, then angles of the triangles are Shall we stop here? Please do the following homeworks neatly and perfectly in your notebook.